In Ohio, we're learning more about the chaos that erupted at the end of a high school football game over the weekend. This is newly released police body cam footage showing officers using pepper spray. They needed that to break up the huge brawl between the opposing teams, students, and spectators. Dave Nethers with our News Nation affiliate WJW in Cleveland has more. The game of rivalry between two Akron schools, each of them still hurting from the recent death of a student athlete. This game is over. October 14th, Akron Ellett and Akron Firestone spar on the field. <laughs> Police body worn cameras capture a different sparring afterwards. Just so much all at once. People started to move that way. Mm. Some of the kids yelled, they're fighting. Let's go. I just get the flying, boom, 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 they flying. They tackle, they tackle me, punching me. I guess. Which kids? Firestone. Okay. They throwing, they just throwing punches. They not looking to see who they punching at. They just throwing punches. How many people do you think were fighting? I've seen about 15 or 20. <laughs> An officer's body worn camera appears to show the officer using pepper spray to break things up. They say do nothing to me. Somebody she said a girl got maced. I saw the coaches were over there trying to push people back. There were still more kids moving forward. Um, okay. So my players, I saw some Ellet players. I saw a lot of fans, um, and that's when. Um, I saw the officers take out the can of mace, so I tried to move back because yeah. I didn't want to get mace tonight. What started the fighting is believed to have been a Firestone celebration after their victory. There's a lot of people fighting, basically. Yeah, we know why they're fighting. Yeah, that's what they were saying. Yeah, yeah. Um, saying it, and the actions, doing it, acting like you're swimming on, um, you yeah. know, on the field. The swimming motion interpreted as taunting by Ellett students whose teammate, 14-year-old Touche Pope, drowned in Lake Melanie near Uniontown during a football team outing in July. Akron schools releasing a statement strongly condemning the abhorrent and unacceptable behavior. They hit me in the eye a couple times. I don't know if my eyes are clear or not, but they punched me in a couple times in the eye. Ellett boys trying to get them off me, punching them too. They both was fighting. Well, all my years working, I ain't never seen nothing like that. Yeah. In its statement, the Akron School District said it will pursue disciplinary action against any individuals found to have participated in this large altercation. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.